Today we're building a handy map app that makes it easy to move smoothly through tourist attractions, discover what's nearby, and navigate with step-by-step, turn-by-turn guidance along the way. Go to bolt.new and write in the prompt. Let's build a map called Danny's Map, similar to Waze. Use Bucharest, Romania as the location. I also want to connect to this map. Tell me at the end which map documentations you are using to create this app. Bolt.new uses a Claude agent. Codex is unavailable for now. We also have a V1 agent, which is a legacy agent. This is our app. Let's give Bolt.new permission to access our location. I am going to hide my location. Trust me, it's displayed correctly. Our agent uses OpenStreetMap, which is a world map free to use under an open license. Let's play around with this map to see what we can build. I want functions that calculate distances between pins I place on the map. Let's try to report a police car in traffic as we do with Waze. Let's set high severity. And here is our agent icon. Let's add pins to our map and calculate the distance between them. Let's say walk one. Let's say walk two. The dashed line that connects the two pins is not very visible. We will change the color, and I also want the distance displayed in kilometers. Now it's looking really nice. Let's add two more pins, car one and car two. How can we remove these pins? We need to add a reset button. This list of pins looks really nice. Let's try to delete the pins, and it's working. I want the button that displays my location to be placed in the middle of the taskbar. I don't want the Waze functions anymore and I'm going to remove them. I was just experimenting. I have a list of the 20 most important tourist attractions in Bucharest. I will ask the AI to look for these sites on the map and add pins. Let the AI do its job. People's Salvation Cathedral is positioned in the wrong place. National Museum of Art is okay. Let's customize the icons a little and put them inside a circle. When I hover over them, I want a short description, an image, and a category to be displayed. Hover effect is not working. Carroll Park is not positioned correctly. I asked the AI to position it correctly several times, and it did not go where it should be. The Attractions button is displaying a list with all our sites and looks really nice. I like it. The Carroll Park icon is not displayed correctly, so at this phase, I need it to step in. I asked the AI to create some functions that let me add all the pins. This panel looks okay. Let's solve this error. Let's try again. I don't like this icon. The hover is still not working. Let's add functions to edit custom pins. Meanwhile, let's explore our database inside bolt.new. Go to the database and see our tables. Let's see the tourist attractions table. We have columns, name, description, latitude, category, icons. Let's see the custom pins table. It's okay. Now editing and deleting pins is working. I don't like adding photos via URL. I want to attach them so they're stored in our database. Let's try to add a new pin again. Now we can upload photo. Let's add a name and an icon. The hover is really nice. I want to display the image I uploaded instead of icons for the custom pins. Now it's okay. Let's add the functions for custom pins to all 20 sites I gave the AI to add to the map. Let's add categories to custom pins. Now we have a category shown when we hover over custom pins. Let's try to edit this pin. It's working. Let's try to add the functions for custom pins to all 20 sites I gave the AI to add to the map. Let's try to change the icon for this pin into an image. It's not working. It's easier to remove all pins the AI added automatically and add them manually. This is where Carroll Park should be. Let's try to delete this pin. And it's okay, let's add it again.
let's add another pin for Old Town. Nice. Let's add another pin for the National Museum of Art. I had issues with the card box that displays when I hover over pins and ask the AI to fix it. Let's add a pin for Bucharest North Railway Station. Nice, check if it's added to attractions. And it is. Let's add a pin for the airport. Let's add a pin for Vakaresh Nature Park. I want to zoom in for sites I choose in the Attractions panel. Let's check navigation for our pins. It's looking really nice. Everything moves dynamically. Let's try the filter. It's working. Let's add a parking lot pin. Check if it's working, and it is. Let's add a pin for a forest. And it's working. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like, share, and subscribe.